Hey guys, Kiki here uh, with a Vista slash XP tip today, but uh, I'll be showing you on Vista today. So what I'm going to show you how to do is set program default and uh, how to set it for specific program extensions and stuff like that. So um, first off, you're going to want to go start off by going to start. Oh, first let me explain this to you. Now let's say, for example, you have a .avi file, and by default it opens up with Windows Media Player, but let's say you have something like VLC or, um, uh, let's see, VLC or, or, you know, all, Real Alternative or Media Player Classic, whatever it may be, and you want it to open with that instead. And you want it specifically for .avi files. I'm going to show you how to do that. Or any file, actually. Just go to Start Menu, go into your Control Panel. Now, for the program defaults, this should be specifically for Vista, but XP has its own different things within its control panel. You're just going to want to go into your uh, control panel, open up Programs for Vista, and for XP will be Programs as well, and then go into Program Defaults on uh, XP. You can just click Default Programs, and say set or add a associate file type or protocol with a program. Now, this is for the extension. Now for set your default programs, this means make a program that default for file types protocols it can open. For example, let's open this. Wait for it to load here. It has to load all the applications that are on the machine. So for to set a default program for file types protocol, click the program and click then set as default. For example, we'll wait until this loads here. So when you write, have you ever, hang on, so you have specific programs here, Firefox and then you want to if you can you can choose the default for this program, or set this program as the default. For example, for as in the web browser and uh, you know search explorer, your media player, your media center, all that stuff can be changed over there. Now getting to more advanced things, that would be associate a file type with the protocol. Click that; it's going to open up the same thing, and you're going to wait for it for that to load. Sorry about that. And just wait for it to load. Keep on loading. Sorry about the dog noise in the background. Dog barking. Neighbors. And just wait for this to load. It takes a while because it has to get every single extension, meaning .avi, all in alphabetized order. So every single... Maybe you'd be surprised how many uh, file extensions there are. You may just know about some, but there's some that are in your core system files. So .386, .acf, .acs, and how you can set this to open up with by default is, for example, .avi, a video clip. Now... You just go into the program and hit change program. And right now it's set to default by media, Windows Media Player. Now you can set it to whatever your recommended programs you have or any other programs you have. Or you can even browse for the program and set it. So if you just install a third party player like VLC, you can just put it there if it's not in the recommended programs already. So this is really useful for MP3s if you have iTunes and other things you want it to open up with, you know, stuff like that. Really, really useful. And, you know, if you don't know what the extension is, look into it, because it, it gives you a good description, it gives you a what the current default program is set to, and what the extension is, so you can look that up. Anyways guys, that's all for today, that's how you set some program defaults within Vista or XP, like I said, it's going to be different for each operating system. Anyways guys, hope that helps, thanks for watching.